Hey, what's going on, y'all? Check it out. We doing a stir fry today. So we got our normal contenders, some bell pepper and onions, some soy sauce, some sweet soy sauce, some oyster sauce, and hey, we got some imitation crab meat and some cauliflower. But anyway, let's get it. And while you're here, don't forget to give me that LSS. What's that you say? That's that like, share, and subscribe. That like, share, and subscribe. And if this is your first time here, glad you're here. Hope you become part of the LSS family, y'all. Because we love Tasty. So, of course, we're going to start off by chopping up our veg. So, let's go ahead and get this bell pepper chopped up. We're going to go down each side. First, the yellow. But you know what? My knife is just a little bit dull. Let me go ahead and hit it on this knife sharpener a couple of times. And then we gonna go move on to that green one. See, that's a whole lot better right there, y'all. That's a whole lot better. A sharp knife is your best friend in the kitchen, y'all. So we simply gonna chop them up. Then we're gonna move on to our onion, which we simply gonna cut in half and then chop up the whole onion out. And this is our veg once we done. So now to our wok, we're gonna add in two tablespoons of sesame oil, y'all. Sesame oil. And then we gonna get our veg in. Now that sesame oil is gonna give us a flavor that you can't get from olive oil. So if you can't get sesame oil, you can use olive oil, but if you can get it, definitely use that sesame oil, yeah. It really brings a flavor. So let's go ahead and give this a mix and mix. Breaking all those onions up as we go. And once we get everything broke up, of course, you know we gotta go ahead and rain on it. Gotta go ahead and hit it with a little dose of salt, y'all. Not that much. Just enough to sweat them vegetables. And you don't want to sweat them too much because you want to get a nice char on them. So let's mix that on up again once we get that salt on. And now it's time to add that multicolored cauliflower, y'all. I love me some cauliflower. I don't know about y'all. But I'm a veg head, so it is what it is. Love my veg. So yeah, y'all, when y'all reach this point, see how you start to get some char on the vegetable. See that nice char on everything? That's flavor, y'all. That's flavor. And that's what we looking for. Just one more view of that chart. See that chart? So after we get that chart right, it's time to get our sauces in. Now, so we gonna start off with a tablespoon of sweet soy sauce. A half a tablespoon of oyster sauce two tablespoons of soy sauce then we're gonna go ahead and get at a quick mix mixing them flavors together
Once we get that mixed in, we gonna add in just a little bit of honey, y'all. Just a little bit. Y'all know I love me some honey. And then we gonna go and get our crab meat in. Our imitation crab meat, to be exact. So of course, you know, our crab meat is already fully cooked. So all we doing now is just warming this crab meat up. Cause really, we ready to eat y'all. So we gonna mix everything together just to get them flavors to start getting into that crab meat. And we gonna let this simmer for about five minutes. And then it's gonna be time to plate up and time to eat y'all. So we gonna start plating by plating our rice first. Now that's me, that's totally optional. You know, I always gotta have me some good rice. Wifey ate hers without any rice. She's not a big rice fan like me, but that's okay. Then we gonna get our stir fry right on top. Oh yeah, y'all. Don't that look tasty? So yeah, let's go ahead and dig in and get us a bite of this here. Give me a piece of this crab meat. Little bell pepper. I ain't getting no cauliflower. Gotta get a piece of cauliflower. And oh yeah, y'all. Look at that bite right there. So tasty, y'all. So tasty. But anyway, y'all know what time it is. Love, peace. And keep it grilling, y'all. See ya.